Hey guys, so we're back here with uh, another workout, me and my brother. So today we got arms to take you through what our main workout is. We keep in uh, most of the primaries that we've been doing. Maybe switch up some of the secondary. So we uh, used to do maybe switch out a few things, try to uh, hit the muscle in a couple different ways. Um, just mainly try and focus on a good pump today. Uh, do some heavyweight, maybe competition on bits a little bit, on close grip. Uh, I don't know which step to see how it uh, goes, but other than that, let's get into it. So first up uh, on the roster today, we've got close grip bench. Uh, it's the first time I've done close grip bench in about a month due to a elbow injury that I sustained to work. Uh, so we're going to just see how things feel. I'd like to go decent and heavy today. Um, at least 315 for sure. Uh, I'm going to try to keep up with board as much as I can. We're just going to see how that goes. So let's get on into it. I can't remember if I said shoulder injury that I got at work or elbow injury. It's an elbow injury um, that I got during training. Landed on my elbow and uh, it was a severely bruised bone. My whole arm was hurting from like the elbow all the way up to like my armpit area. But for whatever reason, I keep saying shoulder injury, even though I know it's an elbow injury. I just wanted to make that clear in case I said shoulder. It's going pretty decent, actually. Better than I thought it would go. So we'll go uh, 365 next. Yeah, that's cool. It's going pretty good. Uh, got a green on the second one, but I'm still going to regain the uh, third one. Probably should be able to pull a hot five today. Okay, so we got one rep that's better than zero, so I haven't done that in over a month, so I'll take one rep. Oh, pretty good. Uh, I think that's tied for most of our gun at that. Um, next up, we'll be going for 55 now. Mine will buy on my own, one four, ten total, I'll take it. That's about my limit for now. 13, you gotta beat that now. Uh,
soon as we take the leg, we're just squats. So literally, for those of you who don't know, whenever he does squats and I don't, it takes him the entirety of my leg workout to do about six sets of squats. So by the time he's done with squats, I've done quad extensions, back squats, pendulum squats, and belt squats. But again, also nobody sees him doing these movements, so who knows? I can name off plenty of people.
been here two days. He is worn out. <laughs> Starting to get a lot, uh, a lot more tired than I was over like the last couple exercises. Uh, definitely like Trinity, he uh, getting to be on this one. Uh, and my brother, we're both dying at this point now. Uh, finished up the rest of the workout, it's been a pretty good one so far. Special for Layton to work there. On to triceps, just finish up biceps. Uh, we'll start and back up, uh, back up with one of my uh, my newer favorites, uh, exercise wise, which is basically uh, rope variation uh, of rope press, uh, extension with press downs. So the main thing with this is how we do we do a super set of it. So we do two different variations. So we'll go uh, the first one we'll go with the normal one like that, and then once we hit maybe eight things up like that, we will step out of it, and then just go straight back, get the arms locked up. So that for me has been one of the better ones. I used to get a pretty good, uh, pretty good pump on it. Uh, I used to tie up my trusses for the best.
already tried these. Definitely need to. These are a great finisher for triceps. They burn the fuck out of the triceps and it's a great one. So if you haven't tried it, go ahead and try those for sure. tricep movement right here um, finishing up gonna just leave everything we got right here empty the tank completely and burn it up as many reps as we can oh. burn them up Dom Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Good one. That's it. That got a lot heavier. Okay, so right now we're finishing up our last two movements, which is going to be biceps, we just finished up the triceps. Uh, so for the last two movements, we're just going to end up with some hammer curls on the rope, on the table, or on the table with the rope extension, and then we're going to do our last exercise, which is going to be uh, reverse, and we'll probably get a stick in that 10 to 12 range, maybe more on the last couple of sets, just to burn up the rest of uh, the energy that we have left, next we just train the day.
Basically, at the end of the workout, my arms were shot. Starting to get to that point where they're starting to cramp during the workout. But, uh, let's get this last exercise, so we got to push through it. Got a couple more sets, and we're done. Pretty much wrapping up the arm day. We got one more set on reverse curls, and that's it. Um, thank God for this humid as hell in here. I'm exhausted and out of energy, and I'm ready to go home. Again. So we just finished up arm day. Um, it's a pretty good arm day. I hit a 405 on uh, close grip bench. Um, I'll take that for not doing that in over a month. Um, overall, a good day. We had a good pump, a lot of good blood flow in the muscle. Um, I said we both had a pretty good day. Me personally, I am dying of thirst. So I'm gonna go to Sonic and get a Route 40 points right away. Yeah. Or you know anything? I definitely say uh, definitely a good day. Uh, both of us are dying right now from the humidity in here. It's so fucking hot. Um, but other than that, we were able to push through it. It wasn't too much talking in this one. Uh, Maybe we just both locked in on our sets, pushing uh, each other, feeling muscle, seeing how everything pumped up good. Um, but not too much talking in this one, mainly just us uh, working out this time. Uh, but I felt like it was still good. Uh, still pretty, uh, pretty good list. I was having to take good bench uh, for close grip, so beat them. But uh, yeah, it felt pretty good. And as always, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next video.